The bonus enclosure series of electronic case clamps are designed for maximum flexibility, closing strength, and speed. They feature heavy-duty vertical and horizontal pressing platens with independent controls for closing dowel joints on both cases and drawer boxes. The efficient design allows for placement in low overhead spaces, features noise-free operation, and low energy consumption of less than one kilowatt per hour. In addition, the machine is virtually maintenance-free since the pressing operation is achieved via electric motors instead of pneumatic or hydraulics. The Closer N2500 FMC shown in this video is an electromechanical case clamp designed for pressing of square and overlapping top boxes. It can press various sizes up to maximum of 98.4 inches long, 49.2 inches high, and 32 inches deep. There's no need to set the measurements of the box. The machine takes the measurements automatically. The pressing cycle starts with low pressure, then increases gradually until the reset pressing force is obtained. It holds the pressure until the clamp is opened. The open cycle automatically positions the clamp six inches larger than the box in the clamp for easy loading and unloading. The clamp can also be equipped with an automatic touchscreen control. The machine is equipped with a double pulley traveler system which quadruples motor power and transfers it to the pressing frame. This ensures square closing of boxes with multiple fixed shelves. Power is adjustable to both horizontal and vertical platens through the easy to use control panel. Minimum to maximum opening can be obtained in 14 seconds. Now, let's look at a complete clamping and build cycle. Delmac regularly builds bookcases and donates them to Habitat for Humanity during trade shows. The Omal Jolly Kala Precision Metering Glue Gun shown here is being used to glue parts prior to clamping. As shown here, we are using the overlapping top function since we have dowels protruding from the top and bottom of the end panel. When using this function, the vertical platen only opens slightly, whereas the horizontal platen opens completely for box removal.
Here we are pressing the frame onto the box so we are only interested in vertical closing pressure. 